a pioneer and provocateur, performance artist Yule dies age 76. The artist known for his pioneering and often dangerous work with Marina Abramovich dies of cancer. The performance artist Yule has died in Ljubljana, Slovenia, age 76. He had been suffering from lymphatic cancer. Born Frank Uvalejpin in Germany, Yuli and his then-partner, the Serbian performance artist Marina Abramović, became renowned for 14 relation works. Conceived over a decade in which the pair lived together in a Citroën van most, if not all, the works involved feats of danger and endurance with the purported aim of annihilating each of their egos and becoming a single artistic entity. In Light Slash Dark from 1977, Yuli and Abramovich knelt opposite one another and slapped each other across the face with increasing ferocity. Three years later, the work Rest Energy saw Yule point a drawn bow and arrow at Abramovich's heart, a slight movement of one finger could have killed her. In a series of performances called Nightsy Crossing, the pair sat in chairs opposite each other for seven hours a day. The lovers, Yuli and Abramovich's final work together, commemorated the end of their relationship. Starting in April 1988, each started walking from opposite ends of the Great Wall of China, Yule in the Gobi Desert and Abramovich by the Yellow Sea. After walking more than 1,500 miles each, they met in the middle and, without speaking, bade each other farewell. The performance caused amazement. Every time I came to a village, the entire village would come and look at me, Abramovich told the art newspaper. Yule first found fame as an artist after moving to Amsterdam and becoming a photographer for Polaroid. Experimenting with the film and cameras the company gave him, his Polaroids from the early 70s explore his own identity, depicting him cross-dressed or self-mutilated. After splitting from Abramovich he returned to the Polaroid, in the early 90s experimenting with a giant camera that produced polygram images duller than the artist himself. In 2010, he surprised Abramovich by taking a seat opposite her during her durational performance piece The Artist is Present at MoMA in New York. The pair had not spoken for decades, but clasped hands and cried. The following year Yule was diagnosed with lymphatic cancer. Two years later the documentary, Project Cancer, Yule's journal from November to November, charted his treatment, life and work. After chemotherapy, Yule went into remission but continued to smoke. He sued Abramovich in 2015, claiming that she had withheld money owed to him and not fully credited his part in their artworks resulting in the Serbian artist being ordered to pay him 250,000 euros, 215,000 pounds, plus costs. In the aftermath, however, the two became friendly again, participating in a 2017 film, The Story of Marina Abramovic and Yule, which charted the course of their relationship. Everything naughty, nasty disagreements or whatever from the past, we dropped, Yule said in the film. It's a beautiful story, actually. Yule's Gallery Richard Saltoon, confirmed Yule's death with the statement, Yule was the freest of spirits, a pioneer and provocateur with a radically and historically unique oeuvre, operating at the intersection of photography and the conceptually oriented approaches of performance and body art. His passing leaves a momentous gap in the world, one that will not be so easily replaced.